Uh, I mean, it was, a, it was a struggle the whole way. Uh, Radford's extremely good. Obviously, the, the two-time defending champ. Uh, and they came out focused and determined uh, and really dictated the, the match. Um, you know, we started pretty well, but then got cut, caught in a couple ruts. Um, and, you know, they're just, you know, Radford's just really good. They're not going to let us out by making mistakes and errors and stuff like that. And we just um, created too many errors on our side. But I, I really love how this team fought uh, through the entire year. I think we've grown a lot. Uh, you know, we've, we've got a bright future, um, a good core group of kids. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm definitely going to miss our three seniors. They've, they're the foundation of what we're building here. And so, and I, and I let them know that after the match. And they're sad. Um, at the same time, they're the ones that really set the tone for um, what we're going to do going forward. And I'm, I'm proud of them for that. But I think, you know, it's, it's just uh, creating expectations um, and higher expectations as we go forward. So, um, you know, last year we, we wanted to get in the tournament. We didn't. This year we did. Um, and now, you know, going forward, the expectation is that we're always here, and then we're moving forward and advancing uh, and competing for championships. So, uh, you know, every step forward we take, I hold the team accountable uh, to that, and so that we're continually, you know, getting better. So, um, like I said, it, it was a frustrating day, uh, but I'm, I'm proud of everything that we accomplished this year. Uh, we've beaten some really, really good teams, and you know. Uh, I'm, I'm excited, you know, looking forward to August, uh, August 1.